hi guys welcome to this vlog as much as i would like to say i just woke up i've been up since six it's ten now so i've been up for about four hours with parker i actually filmed our morning routine with a puppy so that'll probably be up before this vlog so you can go watch that i'll have it up here i think it's up here maybe it's over here but i'll have it so you could go watch that but i figured i would vlog today today is thursday i have a couple things on my agenda that i would like to get done because i work all weekend so for starters i'm gonna shower and get ready for the day semi ready just look more presentable than i look right now but i'd like to kind of just straighten up a little bit around the house my sister and i are going to get our nails done and we're going to the mall do some shopping and we'll see what else the day holds hi baby hi you gonna attack yourself in the mirror okay I just finished my makeup, just did a little subtle makeup because I'm in sweats basically, blow dry my hair, get out of the plant, don't mind the dirt on the floor, Parker now attacks the plant, so, and wires, get off the wires, okay, so I was just saying, I finished my makeup, blow dry my hair, and put on a comfy outfit, just one of Dan's sweatshirts, leggings, and my favorite Reebok sneakers, but my sister just got here, she brought me Starbucks, it's behind me, so we're gonna go get our nails done. Okay, I'm gonna show a little before my nails. They're super grown out and gross looking, but they were pretty cool. It was like a pastel dip. Like all the tips were different colors, so they were cute. Now they're just gross. So I wanna get an ombre, like a pink into white ombre. Yeah, this is my inspo pick. So hopefully they turn out. Okay, we just finished. This is the after. Wow, it's all washed out. Oh, there you go, you can see it. I got an ombre. I kind of wish I would have done a more like round or like a like an almond shape. That's what I thought. Squares done. a little. But I thought it was really cool. It was so cool how she did it. She literally like had to dip a brush in the powder and then she like sprinkled it over the top. She didn't actually like dip my hands in. So this is what it looks like. Watch. I see it. Correct my so Haley actually just started working at American Eagle, so we're gonna go do a little shopping. Hopefully, get some spring stuff. Cause I every time the seasons change, I'm always like, I have no clothes. So I really want to get like some basics, like sports bras Whoa. and like things Bye. I can layer, leggings, bike shorts, like casual, comfy basics that I can wear every day. So that's the goal. And don't let me forget to go to Ulta because Dan and I are out of our face wash. And you want to get Vans? Yes. Yeah. And I'm getting kind of hungry, so maybe we could yeah, get. I'm really hungry. Maybe we could get some Annie Ann's pretzels. Not that anyone was probably wondering, but if you were wondering where my ring went when I was showing you my nails, I always take it off when they put my hands under like the UV thing. I don't know why I feel like it's gonna ruin it, but. Same. And I leave it in. You what? Did you say same? Yeah. <laughs> But I put it in my purse and I always forget to put it back on. Did you spill on yourself? That's karma for being mean. <laughs> nice. Do you have napkins in here? Yeah. Here you go. <laughs> yeah, that's for making fun. But anyway, I put my ring in my purse or my pocket and then I like panic that I lost it. But we have it. We're fine. Okay. We just did some damage. Cute little airy bag, right? The airy? Yeah. But I'll show you guys everything that I got at home. I got a decent amount of stuff. And I didn't realize that you were allowed to use your discount on family and friends. So I didn't say it before. But oh. that's why we went shopping. Oh. Because now Haley has this beautiful discount. She gets 40% off. So we saved a bunch of money. We can't go to the mall without going to Annie Ann. So I got a garlic pretzel. Which probably stinks, but it's so good. Oh, there's so much garlic it's on it. It's gonna smell my car. You wanna out. see it? Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna smell like garlic for days. And so is my car. And your car is gonna stink. So I am home, obviously. I will show you guys everything I got, but I wanna eat something first because I'm starving. It's 3.15 and I haven't had lunch. I just ate that garlic pretzel. So I am making some orange chicken from Trader Joe's. This is what it looks like. I haven't added the sauce yet, but it's just this crispy chicken. I'm making that, I'll probably do some rice. And then yeah, I'll feel much better. And I will show you guys everything I got. You ready to go? You got a wee show? Okay, so I laid around a little bit after I ate because it didn't sit well with my stomach and I didn't feel that good. So I'm up now, Parker's up. He took a little bit of a nap and he seems up and energized and it's so beautiful out. So we're gonna take a little walk 
And then when I come home before we start dinner, I promise I'll show you everything I got. It looks so dirty and we don't have doggy bath soap yet. We're gonna have to bathe him if he goes in there. <laughs> oh my god, babe. <laughs> He's gonna be dirty, and we don't have soap. Look how many of my my parents have oatmeal. All soap. right, come on. No, that's enough. Come on. He's loving it. Don't be scared. It's okay, buddy. Tell him you don't want to. Yeah, you do. Come on. You brave. He can't even walk, walk steady on the rock. Look right here. That's a good boy. Yeah. Go ahead, buddy. It's okay. Come on. It's okay. Just be careful. Come on. <gasps> come on. Good boy. 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 What do you do to you? Uh, we just, yeah, we crossed the creek and it falls are all dirty. Do you, you have doggy shampoo, don't you? Remember in the beginning of this video where I said I wanted to kind of straighten up around the house? Well, I didn't do that. Clean clothes, dirty clothes. Need to put those away and wash those. So hopefully I could do that tonight, but it's like already 7 p.m. We just got home from walking Parker. Dan let him go in the creek, the creek, whatever you call it. So his paws slash arms and legs are very muddy. Not muddy, he dried a little bit, but he's still pretty dirty. So we're gonna give him his first bath so you guys will be able to see that. But I wanted to show you everything I got from Airy slash American Eagle, finally. So I got eight things. And like I said, my sister has the 40% off for friends and family because she works there. So I ended up only spending like I think it was like under 150 for eight things from American Eagle. So I feel like that's pretty good. So first thing I got are these sports bras. I got one in white and in this like purple tan color. I already have this in like a burnt orange color and they're just the most comfortable sports bras ever. They come with pads, but I think I took the pads out of my orange one because it's just more comfortable that way, but super cute crosses in the back. So I got one in this color and then in white. Next up, I got these denim shorts. So these are the comfort, oh no, the highest rise mom shorts with a comfort stretch waistband. So these were super comfy. They have like, like it says a comfort stretch waistband. So they felt like super stretchy and just very comfortable. So whenever I find a pair of comfortable denim shorts, I buy them. So got those. And then speaking of comfortable shorts, I love like oversized lounge shorts. I got two pair from American Eagle or Airy last year I think in like the spring and I love them but they sold out so quickly that I haven't been able to find them so they have a different type of comfy lounge shorts so this is what they look like I got them in this like emerald green color I guess you could say but has pockets on either side and a little pocket in the back they're super high-waisted kind of looks like they were like cut off at the bottoms but very comfortable they only had my size I think in this green color but I want to look online and see what other colors they have because I feel like I will be living in those this summer so a couple more things these are all tops three of them are white and one of them is green so there was a very recurring theme of like white and green here so first top is this one it's just kind of like what do you call that like cinched or ruffled I don't even know but this type of material around like the body of the top and then the sleeves kind of hang off the shoulder and they're like poofed so I thought this was super pretty and it's very comfortable so love that and then I just got this plain white like oversized t-shirt it's kind of like a little see-through-y I don't really know what you would call this material but it's thin lightweight but I feel like I could wear this with like jeans or just with leggings I'm always reaching for shirts like this so that was a good find and then I got this tank top it's just like a ribbed not really cropped but kind of sits like right at your pants with like a thicker strap so got this I thought this was great too I was looking to get like basics but also like pieces I could wear out because I feel like I always buy like like floral pretty tops but then I don't have anything to wear on like just a casual day when I want to put on like a shirt and shorts so I thought that I could dress this up or down so this was perfect kind of like everything except that like poofy sleeved shirt I could dress up or down last thing I got is this tank top again kind of like sits right at the top of your pants has these little thin spaghetti straps and then it's just kind of like a straight across cut in the front in this like what is this like a sage green color but super pretty very comfortable and yeah that's everything I got I wanted to get some new spring slash summer stuff so 
that is all. I'm going to put my hair up and get ready for this doggy bath. So I'm sure it'll be very entertaining. Hopefully he enjoys it. I don't know. And then Dan and I are making homemade pizzas for dinner. So lots of fun things in the next couple hours. Okay, I'm gonna show you how we make our homemade pizzas. So we've been using these frozen pizza crusts that you just put everything on top of and bake from frozen, which is super convenient from Trader Joe's. This is them. They come in a pack of two, which is perfect. We each make one. They're about this size. Dan's is already in the oven, so I'm gonna make mine but we basically just cover it with olive oil and garlic. It's a big Costco garlic, so it's huge. And then we dice up some bell peppers, and by we, I mean Dan, but got some diced bell peppers. Sorry for this angle, this is all I can do in this kitchen. And then we do some chicken. This is what's left. You can't really see it, but got some chicken. And we usually do onion, but we don't have onion, so just chicken and peppers. Oh, and cheese. And then we just put a bunch of mozzarella cheese, and yeah, that's it. We have ourselves a nice white pizza. Okay, here's a pizza before it goes in the oven. Put some oregano on top. Oh, I'm so hungry. It looks so good. Sorry the lighting in our kitchen literally sucks, but you get the idea. There's Dan's pizza. It's our first time using this pizza cutter. It's this great. was our, our Easter gift. My mom got us a pizza cutter and a pizza stone. Looks pretty good. You know if they say anything? You're not going to tell them that I won this one? I didn't know it was a competition. Oh, it's always a competition. You can have some of mine. I will share. Bath is being drawn. Where's the baby? Parker, come here, bud. Come here. I don't want to fill it up too high. Parker, come on. Come on. It's like he knows. Come on, bud. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. It's your first dance. I hope you love it. You're probably going to hate it. Good boy. Come on. Go ahead, bud. This is for you. This is all for you. I think that's deep enough. Okay, bud. You um, ready? Oh God, I think he's scared, I'm scared. Oh my gosh, you got peanut butter? Oh, you put it on the wall? Mm -hmm. Is that what you're supposed to do? Yeah, so we're bathing him with baby of course baby ready. wash. Hey, do you want to get in there? Go ahead, go ahead, get in. Oh! <laughs> Good boy! You put yourself in! Good boy! Good boy, bud! <laughs> What is it? Is it okay? Good boy! Good boy! Good Yay! Boy. Good boy! You need a cup? Yeah. Okay, here, I'll just get one. You look like a wet rat! Ew! Look how skinny you are! You smell like a newborn baby, boy! Lather you up! You smell like in your butthole? Ew! It's mainly his feet. Yeah. Good boy! Good boy! He looks crazy. Now don't lick the soap. You want me to get more peanut butter? You might have to. Hi! You're doing so good! Can we switch? Hi, buddy. Hi, yo, buddy. Ew, this feels so weird. <laughs> this feels so weird. We gotta get his head done. This is the weirdest thing I've ever experienced in my life. Why? It just feels so freaky. Bathe, I've, only ever, a million times. I've only ever bathed humans. To bathe something covered in fur is a little weird. You gonna smell like peanut butter and a newborn baby. I feel like he doesn't hate it. Yeah, he's got so much peanut butter. What do you think he'd be like without the peanut butter? I guess we're about uh, to find out, right? It's a life hack though, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, where'd you see that? TikTok? Um, I might have. Same with uh, cutting nails. They put saran wrap on their head, right? Mm -hmm. And they put peanut butter right on their forehead. <laughs> so the dog looks you in the face. Oh yeah, we yeah. saw that. All right, bud. Good boy. Oh, you in a spa, boy. So, are we gonna blow dry him? I don't want to, but we gotta try him a little bit. Yeah. Let's get that underbelly. Did you get his underbelly? Mm -hmm. Let's get that under. Let's get that, and then we'll rinse you. Good boy, buddy. Come on out. It's okay. Oh God, watch your head, bud. Come on. It's okay. Parker, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Buddy! I hope we didn't get in his ears. Oh. Come on. Come on, bud. Come on, it's okay. Come on, come out from under there. Oh my god, it stinks. Oh god.
God. Come on. It's all right. We're going to dry you off. Come here. You think he'll let me blow dry him? No. Come here, buddy. Good boy. Good boy. Here. Come here. Good boy. Come here. Good boy. Come here. Oh, you're okay. This room's going to stink. You did so good. Should we open a window here? <laughs> it's all right. Good boy. Come here. Oh, he smells even worse. Oh, no. What do we do? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. What? Why do you stink? I got to blow dry him. Yeah. He's soaked. It's okay, bud. He's doing good. He'll lose his mind. What's this? He's gonna feed us. It's okay, we can do it real low. And on medium. Ooh. Are you okay? Ooh. He's okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. I feel good. Good boy. Can we move closer? I feel so bad. It's, it's all right, okay. buddy. It's okay. okay. Grab him, him, babe! It's what are you fine. doing? <laughs> Good boy, bud. Okay, the baby's all clean, all dry, and sleeping, kind of. But he looks good as new. Looks like a fluffy pup. Oh. Oops. Okay, you guys, I'm going to end off the vlog here. Parker is all clean and asleep and in his crate, and Dan and I just came up to bed. We had to shower after bathing him because we were disgusting. We smelled like wet dog and peanut butter, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.